I think I've cried every year on my birthday since I was born. It's just part of the process of getting older. I'll be 21 on March 17. For some reason, I feel like I should have my whole life together by now. But to be honest with you, I never really saw my life past 18. Our 20s should be about having fun, getting to know ourselves, falling in love, learning new things. I'm a Pisces, so I love to romanticize my life. I want to fall in love, deep love. I still do believe in fairy tales. Looking for the love of my life isn't easy. I know I have to go through many heartbreaks to find the one. For now, I'm just going to be focused on something that brings me great joy. My art. Painting on walls, writing, photography, filmmaking. Creativity has always been my outlet. It's how I express myself. I'm grateful to have gone another year around the sun. I think part of the reason why I cry on my birthday is because I feel all the emotions of that year in one day. It can be overwhelming, but I always have a good time on my birthday. For my sweet 16th birthday, I wanted to have a dinner party with my besties. But what I didn't know was my family had turned it into a Justin Bieber theme party. I was so embarrassed. I wanted to cry, but... That's the thing about my friends. They never once made me feel embarrassed about it. And it's a memory I will always love talking about. Remembering moments like that means more than any gift. I owe the woman that I am today to my best friends I was able to make in childhood. I became this confident artist who isn't afraid to speak her mind. To future me, if you are watching this, happy birthday. I love you. I hope your 22nd, your 23rd, your 24th, and your 25th are as good as this one. To anybody that is watching this right now, it's never too late in your life to do what makes you happy. Fuck what other people think. Love your life. Romanticize it. It's not hurting anybody. Also... Happy birthday to the Pisces and Aries of March. I love you guys too.